St. Paul, Minnesota. Since the year 2000, a city with an NHL team at the same address on Kellogg Boulevard. That team is the Minnesota Wild. Greetings, everyone, along with Eddie Olchek, Ray Ferraro in just a moment. I'm Mike Emmerich. A thrill to be here in Minnesota. There are a lot of reasons we like coming here. You pick one of yours. How about youth hockey, Doc? The state of hockey here in Minnesota, no state in the United States has more people playing the great game of hockey. Nico koivu has got lots of responsibility as the leader of this team on the ice, but it also translates off the ice with all those young hockey players out there looking up to the captain of his team. We direct our attention to the Nets and the starting goalies. Dubnik's getting the start in net tonight. He looked them up, and that might translate to a great night in net for the Wild. Andre Pavlich is ready to go in goal. From the hockey prominent city of Kladno, Czech Republic, he's represented his country in two Olympics. No one played more NHL games than he did in 2013, 44 of 48. It's a wonderful night for hockey. Gronlund's the starting center for the Wild. Little's opposite him for Winnipeg. Minnesota's got the puck, and they get to make the first play. And we're happy to have Ray Ferraro with us as well. He is down near the ice. Oh, Doc, you know, you can't get too far into any matchup without discussing the goaltending, and that, of course, is going to have a great deal to do with who wins tonight's contest. But so much of... Score! Boy, they're on the board early, aren't they? Spurgeon's body position was key to be able to snap this one home. Pavlik's not able to catch this one. Too tight to the body, up over his shoulder. hope if you're paying the price of admission as a home fan that your team scores first. In this case, it has. So far, they got their money's worth early in this game. Possession once again by Ryan Suter. And that's an offside. They win the draw and will now set up an attack. Picks it up in his own end. Minnesota's waiting back in their own end. A hammer shot from the point. Moving on in. Great chance, but he missed. Those are opportunities you dream about. You cannot miss the net. That one comes right on his stick. Not very long, but good. With a drive and a save. Minnesota's in their own end, lugging it along. Rister. He covers, and a face-off will follow. A little under five minutes played here in the first. Only one goal, Hank. Oh, a save. Oh, here's a Rister. Score! We're so far up here, Doc. I'm not sure if that puck got deflected. Let's go down to Ray and see what he saw at ice level. Not only was the puck deflected, Enzo, it's through traffic as well. You're going to see on the replay that the goaltender's fighting A, the traffic. He's got to get into position for it. Right when he thinks he's got the puck at him, the puck changes directions. He just can't catch up. Minnesota. 